Hello, this is welcome back to some more Pokemon Platinum Elimination Lock. In last episode, I have no idea what the words are at the moment, but oh well. In last episode, we went from. I keep forgetting the name of the city. Well, we went from one city to Pastoria City or Pastoria Town, one of the two. And in this episode, we're probably gonna, probably blah, 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 probably gonna take on Wake, the team leader over here. But first, team recap. First off, we have Ambrose the Dolphin having the choice band with that nice and ice shard, punch slam, takedown, and rollout. Still waiting to get like earthquake. I don't know, don't know what level he learns to that, but I hope he he still gets it. Uh, Macarena Lucario holding the choice packs with Dragon Pulse, Faking Wave, Blaze Kick, and Cross Chop. Tangle to Tang Growth having the big root with Cut, Mega Drain, Leech Seed, and Saiyan Power. Megatron. The Magaz Magna Zone having the Quick Law, Thunder Wave, Magnet Bomb, Thunder Shock, and Super Sonic. And. Wait, do I still have Pokemon after this? The Kam Exo War Turtle holding the leftovers, which is one level away from evolving. I want to have a Blastoise, we all want to have Blastoise, Blastoise best Pokemon ever, Blastoise best Pokemon, Gen 1. Muddy Water, Water Pulse Protect and Bites. And last but not least, Al Capone the Hunchcrow, having the leftovers with Drill Pack, Paint Attack, Confuse Ray and Fly. I'm just saying, Ash could have had a, a Blastoise in the series, but no. You know why that didn't? That didn't happen because in Japan they introduced Pokemon Green instead of Pokemon Blue, and that's why Blastoise wasn't the thing. Why Charizard is such a well-known Pokemon instead of Blastoise? Otherwise, people would have been mad, mad sure about Blastoise. Because I think Pokemon Blue in the U.S. sold like more copies than Fire Red uh, than Red was even close at, and if it wasn't for Green. Uh, uh, there Barry is. Uh, I mean, Matt. Uh, whoopsie. Uh, I'm not always going to blow into you every time we meet. So, uh, how's it going, Grudger? Buffing up your Pokemon, eh? I'll test you and your Pokemon out to see how buff and tough you are. Come at me, bitch. I will take you on. And it sends out an Aggron. Level 34. That's nice on par. Oh, shit. If I had a fighting type, I was gonna say if I had a fighting type move, I would have just used it on you directly. But yeah, I have a Mechorin. Ironet, you're gonna try and flinch me out. Wow, I do not appreciate that. Here, take this cross chop. Four times effective. The same way my Aaron went. The four times effective critical hit. <laughs> that thing ain't living that. Ambrose leveled up, yep, just like I thought it would. Next up is a Ralts. Mm, let's go El Capone. Because El Capone is actually a proud member of my team in both Insurgents and Platinum. Actually, I'm hoping for, for like a, a Squirtle in one of those eggs. Uh, probably not happening, but still. Would be nice. Can you have like more threatening Pokemon? Glaceon. Oh shit. What do I have for a Glaceon? It's rock. No, no, no. I can just go fighting type against it. And it's probably gonna expect me to go for a counter. So I'm gonna go for a vacuum wave. Uh, well, it's probably expecting me to go for a physical fighting type move. But no. I'm gonna go for vacuum. This is level 36. That's gonna survive it. I see wind. Okay, thank you. So it didn't even go for uh what's it called? Counter or mirror move. No, not mirror move. I keep forgetting the other the equivalent of counter. I keep forgetting what it's called, and thank you for the experience. Holy shit. Man of people, I'm just staying in. I'm getting Mikrin up to level 35. Man of me, man of me, man. Yeah, I can tell you raised your Pokemon to be tough. Oh yeah, choice picks. 
Oh, that's right, I'm Choi Specs. Those are the kinds of things that I forget. Like, in Pokemon Showdown, at least you're able to, like, see it. Oh my god, no. I made a terrible mistake. What the fuck was that? Okay, die. What the fuck was that? Why did that... You nearly killed my Mechorin. This thing nearly killed Lucario. I did not see that one coming. It was just a bubble beam. What just happened? You're telling me I lost? The hell? <laughs> Maybe you did get a bit tougher since last time. That even shocked me a bit, so yeah, I got beat because I was careless. Oh yeah, I joined Mr. Wake well, as a, an apprentice. Look, like I want my own teen song. Anyway, let's heal up Mechorin. Because he was in grave danger just now. Thank you for the level up. <laughs> oh, wow. That scared the living shit out of me. Let's put comics in front because we all know why I want him to level up. Wait, do I actually still have that rare candy? I think I do. No, wait, do I? Did I never use a rare candy? Wait, this rare candy or medicine? Yeah, I used it. Too bad. Anyway, we still have like a lot of trainers to fight over here, so... Hopefully... Well, I'm gonna have to battle you anyway, little kid, so I'm just gonna... Go through here. Yeah, you... People can just skip you, so I'm just gonna talk to you directly. Shield on, which is a nice... Level 33! This thing doesn't have sturdy... Oh, it's, it's confused. Like, when they don't run sturdy, then you know it's, um... Well, when they use Endure, you know they don't run sturdy, so... That's nice. Xatu. I use Bite. Xatu is Merkel Eye. Wait, what does Merkel Eye even do? Oh, it's a, it's something like over, um, Foresight. And that thing lifts. Ow. That's actually a bitch move when you're up against a dragon type and you use like outrage against you. Uh, from part of this, I'm just saying in. Like me, if you use me first against a, a dragon type, as he tries to attack you with outrage, then you're pretty much set. Well, as long as you have like a good special attack or something, I don't know. Oh, I was so looking forward to that level up, but no, you didn't give it to me. Ah, uh, here you are, little kid. My buddy, my buddy isn't the only thing I work on toughening up here. I also work on my Pokemon and my spirit. Da, 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 da. Elite Trainer Zoe sends out Snowbird. Well, the comics is not gonna stay in against that thing. God damn it, Hill. Um, for a Snowbird, I'm not gonna go into El Capone because I type it. And he just swaggered me. Might as well go for a cross job then. Because you just raised my attack, so might as well abuse it and go for a nice cross job. Can I now. Wait, you only had one Pokemon? Come on, I just want my Squirtle to evolve! God damn it. Elite Trainer Webster sends out the pin. This is gonna be some nice experience. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Give me that experience. Ah, nom 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 nom. Guys? It's about that time. A Crowley. Well, I could stay in, but I don't want to because I just noticed I have three P three Pokemon that are weak to fire. I'm just gonna roll out everything on your team. Like nothing really resists rock, so except a Reggie Rock. I know I could have just stayed in, but. Wait, does rock resist rock? I don't know. Does it? Now don't ex wait, no, I I have a good sp physical defense. You can explode on me if you want. Wait, what? 
Okay, I'm not gonna finish that sentence. Explode! Superpower. Nope. Denied! Guys. It's about that time. For my daily dose of Blastoise. Blastoise! Hell yeah! Are you gonna learn Skull Bash again? No! Oh! Here we have him, Blastoise! He's finally with us! With nice and a hundred special attack. Muddy Water Waterfalls protect and bite. Oh, it's too bad that I have to put him in the back. Because he's level 36 and I'm just gonna talk to you because you're gonna ignore me. But it's Swampert. Well, I don't think Swampert can really touch me because Stone Edge is a... What's it called move? It's an egg move and you probably don't have it. No, you have Foresight. Like, why the fuck not? Well, Uncle Punch is also leveled up. Swine up! Well, Swine up is not gonna appreciate... This. Go, Vacuum Wave. Like, I think Swine up doesn't have the best special defense. Like, it's hard to tell if something has a good special defense or a physical defense. Like, if you look at Lucario, you know he's not gonna appreciate anything. Like, he's, he looks so thin and easy to break. Like, fragile. But then you look at Megatron and... He's just straight up steel, so he probably has a good defense. Even though I don't know it outside of my head. Being number one in the world doesn't mean a thing. I have to sneeze again. Just saying. Okay, sneezing is gonna be a daily thing from now on. Oh my god. Really, I do not appreciate sneezing. Jolteon, I am not staying in against this thing. Fuck off. Go Ambrose. Oh, it went for double kick. Oh shit. Oh wait, no, I just went for a... This thing probably has static. Please don't have static, please. Yeah, well, I was gonna kill Jolteon is fragile, but... No static, yes! Grovile? Oh wait, Al Capone's level 36, never mind then. Um, for Grovile, I have a Blaze Kick on Mechwin. That I could easy, easily go for against this thing. And it even kills! I was actually doubting if that was gonna kill or not, because my, I don't... Uh, I'm a modest nature... So, well, I, I, uh, yeah, I'm modest nature, so I'm a special attacker. Because I'm still waiting for that one move that everybody's waiting for when he has Lucario, and that is Aura Sphere. Like, Aura Sphere and Vacuum Wave are, like, the, one of the only special uh, fighting type moves. Oh wow, and I missed because of your fucking sand attack. Thank you. Oh Megatron, you're so big and so strong. The wave didn't even crash. Okay, we're at the end. Our team looks pretty decent, I guess. Well, actually, oh wait, Al Capone, you're in front. What the fuck? Actually, never mind. Let me go back and heal. Astoria City. Like the thing is, 
right now my Pokemon are very damaged. Which is a very big problem. And I remember Surf being somewhere inside, well, the Safari Zone. I'm not sure about that though. Like, HMs are something that I forget from time to time. Like, where they are. And then I'm just sitting there like, in the middle of an episode like, Wait, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? Where the fuck do I find this HM again? What is life? How am I a Pokemon master if I don't even know that? Um, yes, this button. Which brings it down to half. Then I press this button and goes all the way down. And then I can continue against, well, this final button that we have to press. Hello there, Wake. His name is John Cena. Welcome. I don't get I don't get challenged very often. The glory you are now beholding is the Pistoria gym leader. That's right. I'm John Cena. <laughs> My Pokémon were toughened up by stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Victory will be ours. Come on, let's get it done. You're challenged by John Cena, not Clark Scarlet. And he sends out the road raid against my Dolphin. Nope. Nope, this is not gonna happen. Go El Capone. Wow, my evasiveness. Well, it's not like I'm faster than... Does Sweet Scent have like a... Priority? Or is my El Capone slower than that thing? Crobat! Well, for a Crobat, I have a nice Megatron to deal with it. Megatron is the best thing you can use against a Crobat. Flying type, I can just use a Thundershock. Poison type, I can just resist it because I'm steel. And I four times resist the uh, flying type, so. I'm practically... This thing is immune to... Oh, the quick claw popped. I'm gonna kill it. A dodo. Well, I can just stay in against this thing. Level 37. Oh, the quick claw popped. I'm gonna kill it in one hit. I think. Yeah, it's a dodo. -do. It's not living. Megatron became level 36. Oh, Megatron, you're so big and so strong. Ha <laughs> ha! It's gone and done. How will I say it? I want more than this. It seems the under Tau pulled me the under. But I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this. You need that fan badge to use a hidden move Surf outside of battle. This is a special reward for, from me in recognition of your team's power. And this is... Muddy Water? Oh, Brian. It inflicts double damage. We double the damage on targets with less than half their HP left. Use it to end battles quickly. Okay, uh, John Cena, I'll be on my way. I'm not sure about doing something... For this video and if I did it then I'm sorry for your ears oh yes you got the gym badge here huh what what did I tell you master uh, Cena I mean um, the master is pretty awesome hey oh no bumping into each other what's this racket then oh it's you two oh John Cena listen kid I know your father I won't deny that but I don't recall ever taking you on as an apprentice not in the least Besides, you two don't need me. You can become strong on your own without being my apprentice. It doesn't matter. I made you my master, John Cena. I decided it. But forget that. There's trouble brewing. There's a steaming galactic goon in front of the observatory gate. He said something about using a bomb. What? No one messes with Bastoria, not in my watch. 
Hey, Master Wait. I just keep thinking like, should I say John Cena or just straight up Master? Let me heal up before I go up against his grunts. Am I glad that that final Pokemon was a Dodo? It's level 37, so... From now on, Pokemon are gonna become like low, higher level than I am. Which is actually good, because it should start becoming more of a threat. Are you serious? Matt, are you fucking serious? Look at this guy. Does my new outfit look good or what? Krogan's where is that? Why? Just why? Hey! What am I? Chop liver, don't forget I'm here too. So, where's this Galak? Oh wait, it has its own sound effect. Okay. It has its own sound effect. Whew, that was rough. You, what have you done? What I've done? You're asking? Well, technically speaking, it wasn't me. The package that I arrived, see, that was a bomb, named the Galactic Bomb. Me, I was told to push the button, so I did, like, boink. Oh, that's right, mustn't forget the test results. Need reporting. Cheerio, then. You doffed, codger. Codger, your mask's absurd. What? The Great March is invaluable. You two, do not follow me. Don't let anyone else in here. There's a big trouble if there's any of that bomb left. Hey, Grazzle, you go after the Galactic Goon. I'm staying here like Master said. Gotta keep going. Uh, don't let the Galactic guy get away. I'm coming for that ass, alright? Hey, you. What's with you? Stop chasing after me, you. I have, half a, I have half a mind to pulverize you with my Pokemon, but I have to be on my way to get the lake. Alright, do I make myself clear? Do not dare to follow me. Bitch, I ain't give a fuck about you. I'm just here to fuck you up. We need to energy from Oak Valley Whitworth to make this. I would take a scientific genius to make something like this. Therefore, our boss who made this as, as a scientific man, mechanical genius, blah, blah. Huh, you were eavesdropping? I was just thinking out loud. But I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. Well, I'm going to waste my energy, energy knocking you around. Because I'm going to find you. I'm going to pulverize you and I'm going to touch that ass. But boy, that Galactic Bomb packs a pretty big wallop. With this baby here, there's not much we can we can blow up. I wonder what they've planned for it, this. Ah, uh, you're eavesdropping? Uh, no, you're persistent pest. I'm getting tired of running away, but I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. Oh, looker! Hello, my friends! This cargo that the Team Galactic brought is, is worrisome, so I have come. You say that cargo, it was a bomb? And there was an explosion? That explosion was at the Great March? Furthermore, you are pursuing a man, a man with a funny bull cut hair. An outfit that is very strange. In other words, that's the Team Galactic. Oh, no, no, no. How did I miss it? Oh, looker. This time you have made a mistake of the ages. The man who I, I have seen running away, he was the bearer of the bomb. Uh, this will not do. Wait, wait. Wait, I say. Looker, don't go after him yourself. You're gonna get yourself killed somehow. Oh. Ah, my friend, it is you, yes. I'm at your this hotel now. I'm interviewing the people to see if they s saw anyone suspicious. I would like you to assistance. Go search outside, if you will. The suspect, the suspect he may have already slipped away ahead of, unnoticed. Well, he's pretty much almost at the lake right now. If my memory serves me right, and he's here. <sighs> Why am I running like this anyway? That new world, the new universe that our boss was talking about. It's making me giddy thinking about it. When we use this thing, eh? Your ears are ringing. Oh no, your position. Eh, I'm from my house is ringing. I'm not going to battle you. I'm out of your bitch. Well, um, uh, ah uh, no, you stole my deal. Legs are within sight. You leave me no choice. My Pokemon will KO you. Well, unless you ping. You bring something like a Dialga, I am not gonna be afraid. Okay, Gengar is pretty scary. 
Go, El Capone. Is it actually Al Capone or El Capone? Oh, Shadow Punch. Not very effective. But this thing is gonna outspeed me. And definitely gonna outspeed me and just use Shadow Punch again. Okay. I don't know why it went for Shadow Punch twice. Instead of something like a Thunderbolt. Well, Thunderbolt is a TM that it learns, but still. <sighs> if I didn't run, I could have battled harder. <sighs> I can't battle anymore. I'm running on fumes. I'll have to give this to the commander. I wish I got to use it at the leech. Look at him, just slowly slipping away. Oh, Cynthia. Oh, hello. Long time no see. How is your Pokedex filling up? I came to research the folklore about the lake, but, well, it doesn't appear as if the lake is open to the public now. Have you heard the folklore about it? They say there's an island inside the lake, and inside that island is a mirage of a Pokemon. Enter the chamber, the chamber of that Pokemon. Oh, that's right. I have to talk to you about something else. Oh, Matt. Grizzle, where's that Galactic Goon run off to? Huh? Is this your older sister? Uh, no, she isn't. Oh, okay. Um, not explosion at the Great March. It wasn't anything serious. Mr. Wig told me to tell you that. But the Team Galactic, wow. Are they out of control or what? Next time I see them, I'll teach them a lesson they won't forget. See you around. Why are you running that way? He's your friend? He's more impatient than he is energetic, isn't he? So, getting back to what I started saying earlier. Have you seen the group of Psyduck? Yes. Yes, that's right. By the cafe on Route 210. You've seen that group of Psyduck huddled with their heads in their ha hands. Anyway, what you should do is use this medicine on Psyduck. Psyduck, you're working on a Pokedex, so it should would be worthwhile for you. Thank you. Oh wait, is that where I get, sir? I went on a big adventure with a Pokedex when I was younger. I hope you get to meet every kind of Pokemon there is to see. It may help you with the secret of the Mirage Pokemon. See you later. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh no. Next episode is gonna be a troublesome episode because... Where we are headed... I hate it with a passion. And I don't want to learn any of my... Want any of my Pokemon to learn Defog. No. Fuck Defog. No. That's right, I completely forgot about that place. Like... Before I was like, I'm not gonna let my Magneton evolve before getting to Mountain Cornet again, but then I was like... But then I have to wait until I have to get like past the... Um, what's it called? I still come to think of it, I skipped a lot of trainers. Back in the Turner City, like to the right. Anyways... No casualties so far, but the trainers are gonna co become higher level right now as we speak. So, next up, we're gonna go towards... I don't know what the place is called, but... Yeah. We're gonna go through a misty area, and I'm not gonna appreciate it, and I'm actually pretty terrified of it. But, that's for next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in that episode. Bye.